I have to do a little explanation from what you're about to see because the numbers are really out of context in the show. The young lady's name is Ellen Green. Uh, this is her first appearance on The Tonight Show. And she stars, I called it The Little House. It's The Little Shop of Horrors. Oh, it's great. In which she, I understand, is a wonderful play, in which she plays a kind of a dingbat sales girl who falls for a nebbish who sells his soul to a flesh-eating plant. <laughs> yes. It's your standard... Uh... By the way, I, I, I must interject. I saw the, the play. It, it's a, one of the most delightful evenings in the theater. That flesh-eating plant is one of the most creative pieces of, of, of puppetry I've ever right. seen. It eats people, and you believe it. Well, I don't think we have the plant here tonight. No, no. Have the plant. <laughs> anyway, here are two numbers from this award-winning musical, which is, I said, at the Westwood Playhouse. Would you welcome Ellen Green. Fantastic. <laughs>
wash off your mascara. Here, take my Kleenex. Wipe that lipstick away. Show me your face. Clean as the morning. I know things were bad, but now they're okay. Suddenly, Seymour is standing beside you. You don't need no makeup. Don't have to pretend. Suddenly, Seymour is here to provide you sweet understanding. Seymour's your friend. Nobody ever treated me kindly. Daddy left early. Mama was poor. I need a man and follow him blindly. Thank you, Tom. This is uh, Ellen Green. And the gentleman's name who plays Seymour is Lee Wilcox, right? Lee Wilcox, right. You know, usually when you do shows out of context from, a, from the stage, they don't translate too well. These, these work very nicely tonight. They did? Oh, yeah. The audience loved because it. your atmosphere. Yeah. They were wonderful. Yeah. You're, the people that work here are fabulous. This is, a, this a is the plant that Carl was talking about? Yeah, well, this is a miniature. miniature this is yeah. the original. I, I mean, this is the first one that's ever was made. Yeah. And uh, that's a replica of the show, so the first right. one. Uh, and we tried to get it to work, but it, it was too little to speak, uh, so we said it's a baby. It's, well, it's an egg. It's very nice. It's anyway. an egg. Thank, Thank you. you. How, long you, how long a run do you have out here? Uh, supposedly, I think it's open-ended. Yeah? It's open-ended, very warm house. It's very yeah, nice. Yeah, very nice, huh? Yeah. You're a New York girl, right? Yeah, I'm from New York. When I first came out here, I was so... I was so uh, uh, bowled over by Hollywood when I first came out from the airport. The sunlight that went through my eyebrow, eyelashes, yeah. it was so much, I thought it was going to burn my eyeballs. Yeah. And then uh, when... <laughs> and then they took me up to... Oh, I have to say something. This is Audrey. This is her clothes, her makeup, her wig and everything. Yeah. But inside there's something you'll be nuts about. But she's not here. That's Ellen. <laughs> Yeah. You know, I mean, I, I, it's the first time I'm ever talking in, in my wig and not... You see, I talk like this. You don't meet nice boys when you live on sketch round, Mr. Schnick. Right. That's my voice in the show. Right. That you call me a dingbat. Ah. No. This is your normal voice now. My normal voice? Yes. It's, yeah. Uh, this is my normal voice. Anyhow, when I first came here, they took me... <laughs> they took me... They took me uh, on one of the canyons, 
and we got out to see the view. I almost fell down. There was so much space in New York, you know, there's walls yeah. and steel, you know, and it keeps you up. Yeah. For something. There's so much space, I was very nervous. Yeah. And then I went to see Fredericks of Hollywood. You mean the lingerie? Uh... I was shocked because it was a catalog and I had never seen that. And I walked in and there's all new racks. It was bosoms and bottoms and tushies to go. Yeah, so you, can, you can buy anything that you need, which nature has, I guess, ignored. Obviously, <laughs> you don't have that problem. Oh, oh God. <laughs> I'm very embarrassed. When people, really? when people take notice. If they don't take notice, I'm fine. If they take notice, you know. I'm I'm, I didn't mean to do a say it. No, no, crack, no, no, you didn't, you didn't. You were very, yeah. very, it was very, it was done very. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's just intended. But... Mom, hi. Ah. <laughs> she didn't know I was coming out in this one. Really? No, more covered up. Why? But that, <laughs> were, were you shy growing up? I mean. No, no, I didn't fit in at all. Wow. I didn't fit in. Well, I was sort of a misplaced modifier, a dangling participle. I didn't, I saw, everything I saw was yellow. Yeah. I just, I, I didn't like school, I, but I loved human physiology. Uh -huh. I loved human physiology. I was real good in that. And I only did At the beginning of school, you had to write compositions for right. every school. And they you knew write. then, what's wrong? And I, well, I had to write, I was going to be an actress, singer, uh, actress, singer, dancer, because I wanted to be a witch, fairy, princess, or tell someone off. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know. It's I was, all worked out then. Yeah, but I was in... <laughs> I'm talking in tangents. See, I'm being the character. Yeah. But back to human physiology. Mm -hmm. I uh, was real good in that, and I was... I, I knew all the bones. I knew the bones. I like I liked that. In fact, you would look at you and you'd know, well, that's music. Does that mean we have to leave or something? We have to cut away for a moment. But more about bones in just a moment. <laughs> good on bones. Lee, I didn't mean to ignore you in the conversation. It's okay. nice having you here, too. I hope you have a nice long run. Thank you. With a little shop of horrors, uh, which is the Westwood Playhouse. Will you come back and see us again sometime? I'd love to. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, The Man with Two Brains opens June 1st. At June 3rd. June 3rd. Did your next, friendly... next Friday, actually. Next Friday. The Man with Two Brains. Thank you, Carl. Thank you. Thank you. Have a nice memorial safe weekend. We'll see you soon.